Las Vegas, Jay White recreates Neil Diamond. Every movement, every sound, each expression of every song evokes the passion and the power that is Neil Diamond. Dozens of articles, sold out shows, a national award for best concert performer. This diamond is the most convincing recreation in his field. So much so that 18,000 screaming fans recently packed the park for his two hour concert in Salt Lake City. I just ran off stage like about 20 minutes ago. I just got done with America and ran right over here. So, it was, you know, it's, it's just a lot of fun, and I just wanted you to know how much I enjoy it and how much I appreciate you, uh, uh, you know, accepting of what I'm doing. So, yeah. Keep up the good work. Hello, my friends, hello. I just called to let you know Words that rang in me Even Neil Diamond writes, Jay, keep singing so I can stay home and relax. Your friend in music. Is that, is that Neil Diamond? And that's, is that in 2008, Jay's movie debut in Frost Nixon had director Ron Howard convinced they had found the perfect match to play a 1977-era Neil Diamond. This Oscar-nominated film is destined to become an historical timepiece. I'd like to introduce on the conga drums tonight the greatest conga drum player in the world, Mr. King Arusha! Percussionist King Harrison has played on every album and concert tour with Neil Diamond. I've been with Neil Diamond now from 1974 to now. I guess that's 35 years or so. Well, I'll tell you, he's the closest to Neil Diamond than anybody else I've ever seen. So close to Neil Diamond is that if you were to shut your eyes, you would swear you're on stage with Neil. And I like that about him. The whole thing was good. Everybody standing up good, dancing, everyone. clapping, the having a good time. The yeah. Did you have a good time? Yeah, yeah. It was great. Jay's television appearances and charity events have created opportunities to meet and work with some of the world's most talented performers. And no one heard at all not even the chair. The American public has an unending fascination with celebrities. We just can't seem to get enough of them. Jay White does a tribute to Neil Diamond. Because he's constantly changing, it's probably a little more difficult, but I try and pick a particular era of him that I think people are most going to recognize. We have been talking about this guy throughout the show. Well, here he is finally. It's Neil Diamond. It's Jay White. Yeah, hi, Jay, Sue. it's great to have you here. Thank you, thank you. Uh -huh. And uh, we met backstage right before his show, and he was very complimentary and said he had heard some great things about me and to keep up the good work. And, and you <coughs> had a chance to go to his concert. You were actually sitting right next to his mom. That's exactly. She was, she was sitting right behind me, and she would tap me on the shoulder and say, okay, watch what he does here now. you got to check this out. <laughs> and so she was just so sweet. Even Neil's mother, Rose, proudly calls Jay her favorite. Neil Diamond consistently delivers passion. He's one of those gifted songwriters who puts every ounce of his soul into every song. It's incredible. I almost threw myself at him. I know. I couldn't help myself. I know. I, 
stalker situation. Uh, well, he, hey, he, Donnie Osmond, look out because we got Jay White in the house. Hey, really quick, you're a total Las Vegas guy, not yeah. just for that, but let, let, let's look at this this guy right here. This is the fill-in Wranglers goalie. I'm the, I'm the emergency backup goalie for the team, and I actually dressed for four games in a row in March this month. With his dynamic band or a full orchestra, this exceptional professional entertainer delivers a natural talent with flawless vocals, a touch of humor, and a raw emotion that leaves him standing and cheering for more. All right, we picked this one out in particular because this one's also... What's that? I didn't hear you. One more button? What button are we talking about? You're actually wearing his jacket. It was a, a jacket that he wore on stage uh, in Los Angeles during a Martin Luther King special, a television special that they did wow. uh, in 1986. And uh, he's had it hanging in the closet all these years and, and very much appreciates what I do. So he said it to me. Perfect gift. Yeah, yeah. Love on the rush. I started performing with Jay maybe about six years ago. You know, Jay's golf game, I think, is hockey is better than his golf game. My country to the lady.